Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, Castle the Perfect, bringing you another small tutorial on how to defeat a newly released seven-star raid boss, Blastoise, within Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. Let's jump right in. So the raid event goes from March 6th until March 12th, which is precisely six days, plenty of days to get our hands on Blastoise at least once, right? So Blastoise, just like every other seven-star raid boss, comes at level 100. Uh, has the ability Rain Dish, and knows the moves Hydro Pump, Flash Cannon, Aura Sphere, and Iron Defense. Right off the bat, I can already tell this Pokemon is going to be a defensive beast, but we have something in store for that specific type of Pokemon. It has the additional moves Withdraw, Shell Smash, and Rain Dance, and uh, Withdraw is actually scripted as the very first move that he will set up with before we can actually do anything about it. Its stereotyping will be set to Steel, it's shiny raid absolute zero you cannot get this pokemon in its shiny form from seven star raid bosses you'll have to breed it or get it through other methods so the mightiest mark will of course be available for this blastoise as well its nature is set to naive which by the way increases the speed stats and drops the special defense stats which by the way kind of hints at uh at us the player to use special attacking pokemon if we want to defeat blastoise um much more easier than um using physical attacks so that's something to keep in mind its hp is set to a 35 multiplier right so that's everything about blastos let's go ahead and jump into the counter that i have selected for this tutorial so my pick is galade none other than galade and the reason why i chose galade is because galade knows a move that is very very effective for this type of pokemon right so the galade that i really advise you guys to get your hands on which by the way can be obtained from raid bosses as well you can actually catch a bunch of frauds up in mountain Alberta. so there is a multitude of ways to get your hands on a galid within pokemon scarlet and violet so the idea is is to get this your galid to level 100 which is a minimum requirement its stereotyping will be set to water and the reason why it's set to, ter to water is because it will become resistant to the hydro pump and the flash cannon coming from blastoise that is absolutely essential its health item will be Bell Bell. as per usual we need some sustainability because we don't really have a move that uh, we can use throughout the battle that will heal up enough it has the ability to learn drain punch but drain punch is not effective versus blastoise it, it truly is not but moving along the moves that uh, this galate has will be uh sword dance and sacred sword just two Nothing more, nothing less. That's all you need. The reason why I have chosen this move is because a Sacred Sword is a very specific and special move, right? So the user attacks by slicing with a sword um, and the target stat changes that don't affect the damage inflicted by this move. Meaning it doesn't matter how many times Blastos uses Withdraw, we can always hit its base stats, which is great. But we can also increase our stats to deal more damage with Sacred Sword the base stats of blastoise um, basically ignoring all his stat changes the ability that you need which again is a basic requirement or a minimal requirement is sharp sharpness uh, it powers up slicing moves by 50 percent so if we look at sacred sword as a whole here it's a physical attacking move with the 90 power and 100 percent occurs with its ability sharpness it increases by 50 percent coming out at 135 for each used sacred sword that's very very powerful especially after setting up with a couple of sword stands. If we look at the stats here, you see clearly that I have set 252 EVs in attack and HP, uh, but this Galate has its nature set to careful, right? And careful, what it does is it increases the special defense stat of the Pokemon and decreases the special attack. Special attack we are obviously not going to use because Sacred Sword is a physical attack, and Galate is just in general a physical attacker, not a special attacker so that's all you need to know for uh this uh counter uh, so let's go ahead and jump into the demonstration to show you guys how to utilize this 